Hey everybody, Tony with Hobby Hangover. Today we have Marvel Collector Core's October box, which is the villain's theme. I've been waiting two months for this box. Um, from what I've read from the, uh, the, the makers, Funko, they were going to have an exclusive, never before produced uh, pop in this one. That they said it wasn't going to be a repaint, it was going to be an entirely new mold of someone they've never done before. Um, as you can see here, Venom is on the cover of the box, and whenever a character is on the cover of the box, they definitely have a pop in the box. Last month it was the, um, or two months ago, it was the female Thor, and she was definitely in that box. So I don't know what's in it. I just got it today. I'm going to open it up right now and see what we have. Alright, on the top of the box, they have a patch of a new design. That one is Red Skull, the um, main villain for Captain America. And that's a circular patch. They haven't done um, one in that design yet. Then we've got, also on the top of the box, is the exclusive pin. That's the Green Goblin pin. And that pin is actually the same design style, same shape, and um, it's just Green Goblin this time. And inside the box, let's open it up and see what we got inside. Got the t-shirt. Let's see what t-shirt. The Venom t shirt. Got Venom there. Let me open this thing up and just see. Because I'm not going to do it justice like that. So we've got Venom at the top. This one's one of the Heather Gray ones. The last couple had been in black. You got Loki there. Um, Thanos. Who else we have here? Green Goblin. Red Skull. Ultron. Ultron. So that's nice. And let's see what else is in here. Got the comic, which is has the it's an Iron Man comic, and it's bordered with a plastic, which is something new they've done after the first couple. They got complaints that uh, the comic was coming in bad condition, so they started putting them in the plastics with the uh, the cardboard border. And now let's see what else we got here. It's looking pretty good. Oh, sweet. I love these. This is an exclusive Dorbs, and it's Loki. This is their um, new line. Might even be their newest one is these Dorbs. And everything in these boxes are exclusive, so um, if you didn't, if you don't have the subscription, you're not getting these products unless you buy them all out in the open market. People reselling. So we got the Loki Dorbs. Here is the Venom keychain bobblehead. I don't have I don't have any of these, so this will be my first one of this. And that's a that's a small one for a bobble. I wonder if the keychain will hold up. And the last one, never. This got to be the one that they've never done, and uh, it's a, a mold, an entirely new mold. 
Morbius. That's a bobblehead. I'm not going to open these just to save time. But you can see all, ex all exclusive stuff. This has to be the new mold that they've never done before. Because it's the only um, bobble that's uh, like the regular pops. So overall pretty good. I'm happy with the, the Dorbs because I actually collect some of those. Um, the Morbius, I'm not really that familiar with this character too much. But it looks good. The color scheme is nice. It'll match with uh, the Ant-Man one that they've had recently and the uh, Miles Morales Spider-Man that they put out. So putting those next to each other, the colors will match up pretty nice, which is how I'm going to display them. All right. Um, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Um, I don't think there's anything that I can really scan and put up on my Pinterest or anything, so I won't even plug that. But again, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.